Hola amigos, it's Will here at Will's Custom Figures coming at you today with another big bad breakdown of one of my all-time favourite Welsh wrestlers. Yes guys, a legendary wrestler in Adrian Street. So guys, please sit back, relax while I talk you through why and how I made this and everything else in between. So let's start by why. This is a commission that has been long, long overdue. I've been asked by one of my all-time favourite customers, Dave, to work on an Adrian Street. And as you can see here, he looks really, really cool so far. Using a Papa Shango base and uh, adding on all the lovely trimmings made from clay around the outside. An awesome 3D head sculpt as well. But just for, before I get into all of that, a little bit of a history lesson. This guy's from Wales. He stopped wrestling in 2014 and was born in 1940. This person is a true legend of the sport and well overdue his own figure. I think Shella Toys or Shella Toys, whatever you call them, they are coming out with their own version this year. Have a look at that head sculpt though. Guys, you can't get much better than that. If they do, fair play. I've not seen all of the specifics yet, but the hair, everything about this guy is so cool. So as mentioned, Papa Shango base, the arms were actually from Iron Sheik. So I cut them off. These are actually 3D replica um, hands, that, or arms, sorry, that are uh, silicon casted and then resin, uh, resin, um, molded uh, thanks to my good friend Rob for teaching me how to do that I've then used um, they're actually there's actually massive gaps in between the shoulders because to get them on the angle around the waist originally before seeing the Shella Toys version um, the arms were going to be up in a sort of like you know magnificent sort of um, arms up in the air position celebratory position but we decided to go for this look because this is not the look that they're going for and I don't think there's any other Adrian Street toys that have this kind of appearance. Done the knot here, actually tied a physical knot in the clay, glued it on, did lots of um, scoring all the way down here. You can still see inside the legs, so nice detail there. Um, how I did this, I rolled with a rolling pin about this much clay, nice and long, folded it around, cut it up, uh, made sure it was nice and fastened on the inside, added all the details on, and then I work on the upper body. After I've cooked it all, the head's been attached, um, so you know the hard bits sort of been done these ponytails would all come off I've then added on all of this fur around the wrists and the shoulders as well as then this knot so I'm really pleased with how it's turned out I hope you guys like this man what an overdue figure someone like I've just been so excited to work on for so long and this I don't actually have a copy of, of this head sculpt this is a one-off um, I guess if anyone wants one of these they're probably going to have to find a 3D head sculpt somewhere because oh, this looks phenomenal um, I'd be more than happy to work on one for someone but guys you, you, there's some things that you can do with clay there's some things you can do with a 3D printer so fair play to the designer for making this I am so happy to have an Adrian Street that's going to be added into the collection very very soon I would move this bit out of the way I'm going to bring in, as I love to do, the all-time good guy, Mr. USA himself, the, the Patriot, the absolutely fantastic Sergeant Slaughter, lovely G.I. Joe figure that's recently been launched of him as well. Um, absolutely well-deserved to such a legend of wrestling. And then, of course, you're going to have a bad guy complimented by a good guy. And here is Razor Ramon, Scott Hall, standing, nice, tall and proud, next to Adrian Street. Adrian Street, guys, I'll do a proper breakdown of him and the history of him when I finish this guy, and he's gonna look absolutely phenomenal. I'm so excited to show you guys the finished products. So please, guys, final reflections. I'm excited to get this guy finished and show you what he looks like. Got a really, really interesting outfit to work on for you. Please like, comment, subscribe. Feel free to comment and follow me on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube. Get in touch if you want one of your own and I can try and help you source the parts or even work on bits for you. And uh, thank you again for tuning in, guys. Until next time, from myself, from the one, the only, the legend himself who is still well involved in the wrestling business to this day, Mr. Adrian Street. It's been a pleasure speaking to you. Peace.